Waxy's World. It's awesome. Waxy's World. Waxy's World. Have some fun. Waxy's World. Waxy's World. Like and subscribe. Hi everyone, I'm Waxy. Welcome to Waxy's World. Well, I kind of, sort of, have on the uniform that represents my next subject for today. What makes C's candy great? Now watch to the end of the video. I've got some info on a volume discount program for employers or businesses. And I'm going to do a taste test between C's and Godiva truffles. Oh, the good part of my job. Okay, here we go. C's Candy, founded by Charles, Florence, and Mother Mary C's in Los Angeles in 1921. Now the C's family was originally from Canada. And by the mid 20s, they had 12 of their candy shops. Their black and white trademark scheme with the checkerboard shop, all black and white inside, the employees dressed in black and white, that began in 1941 in the Bakersfield, California shop. Now, believe this or not, I did not know this. The C's family sold the business to Warren Buffett in 1972 for $25 million. And Warren Buffett, in, in 2007, Warren Buffett called it the prototype dream business. They currently have 245 shops in 21 states, and they also have a large online presence and many kiosks. In 2019, C's Candy did sales of $460 million. So not bad investment, Warren, as usual. Let's talk about the quality of their business. The brand in California is impeccable. I mean, it is so known and for quality. And their retail shops are famous for cheerful, helpful employees. Now their chocolate itself. The raw bulk chocolate that they use is purchased from Guitar Chocolate Company, which is very close to them. That company, Guitar, is a French company and was founded in 1868. Now all their nuts, their almonds, their walnuts, pecans, all their nuts are provided by Mariani Nut Company and that's just 20 miles from the C's plant. Speaking of the C's plant, I did not know this. The I Love Lucy show. The famous scene of Lucy and Ethel when the candy's going by so fast and they have to stuff it down their shirts, they got it in their cheeks, they're trying to keep up. That was filmed at the C's Candy Plant in Los Angeles, very close to the Desilu Studios. So, very interesting there. Now, C's produces over 26 million pounds of candy each year. Everything's made from scratch, only using the raw coverture, as it's called, chocolate from guitar. Critics and consumers rave about the C's Candy products, and the business and service itself. Now me, why do I think C's Candy is great? Well, the great thing about them is when you give a box or receive a box, there's usually a great memory attached to it. And also, there's usually a kiss or a hug as a thank you. So that makes the giver of C's Candy and the receiver of sees candy very happy so I think that makes them great now my favorite is the caramel patty I love those also what I like is when you walk into one of the sees candy shops you immediately identify it as an old-school icon it's clean friendly it takes you back in time to a natural quality business and you're not really worrying about or checking the prices because you know that it's so exceptional product that it is still a great value, irregardless of price almost, within reason, you know. 
I love the fact that when you make a purchase, when you go to the store and you make a purchase, you go through the line, they give you a free piece of candy with every purchase. And that's really cool and nice touch. These are the things that I think make these candy great. And I mentioned to you some of the other reasons that have built up their name and reputation. Now I'm gonna put on the screen over here, the details on the business slash employee discount for bulk purchases. And you can check it out here. You can also go on their website and learn about it on their website. Okay, the fun part, I get to taste some chocolate truffles. So let's do this. Now normally, you know, the C's one pound, two pound, three pound boxes are the white and the black. And I think they did their truffles in gold to kind of distinguish it just being a box of truffles. I think they also have a, a silver box that has a, another type of candy in it. So I'll open it up and kind of, if you've never seen this before, let you see it. They all look beautiful and nice. Now on the Godiva, I just bought a little small packet of Godiva. So let me get this open here, fill in the time. And, okay, so let's pull out. See, those look pretty good too. So I'm gonna set that one there. And then the match for that one is right here. You can see they're very similar, a little bit different shape. So I think I'll spin them around, spin them around, close my eyes, spin them around. It uh, doesn't matter, I can feel the shape. Oh well, let's just try it. Mm. So good. Wow, that's hard to beat. Godiva. So, the distinction I have right away is the chocolate is a little more bitter, where it seasons more creamy. It's still a dark chocolate and it still has plenty of chocolate flavor in it. I prefer the C's. It is more creamy yet chocolatey. And the Godiva is chocolatey, but not too creamy at all. So I'm a fan first of the C's, but second of Godiva. An excellent product as well. Well, I think I'm gonna let you guys go so I can finish this box of chocolates because you never know what you're gonna get in a box of chocolates. Thanks again, please like, subscribe, ring the bell. We'll see you next Friday. Waxy's World, Waxy's World, it's awesome. Waxy's World, Waxy's World.